Hey everybody, it's me Jace and I'm back with another tutorial and it is for a design called the Sabrina, okay? Sabrina was created by Janet today and I like this bracelet so much. It is so easy to make. I made so many in just an hour, okay? So here are the three different variations that I made wherein I mixed colors alternately and also one color after the other. There's three per side. So what I did was that. And then here I did two colors for the first two and then one color um, for the last one. And then here I made one color for the first one and two for the last. So it really depends on how you want to mix it. But it's super easy to make. You guys are going to love this and it looks so elegant. Okay. And just so you can see how many I made. I made another one with beads. Ta-da! <laughs> It's so pretty, okay? It's so pretty, oh so pretty. And another one with super big beads, but the big beads also look good, ha ha ha. And this is going to be a gift for a friend, a lady friend who is so much into the bling blings, okay? So this is the beautiful Sabrina bracelet and I will teach you, they can barely fit the screen. <laughs> There's five already. So here is the Sabrina bracelet created by Janet today and today I will teach you to make this okay so what we will do is we will use three colors alternating for segments so the first segment is going to be white the next segment is going to be uh, gold mint and then that color that you see in the middle that gold it will also still be gold for me so I will do that and let us start first you get a single cap band on your hook like that and then you get another band this is basically a 10 loop configuration so you place your cap band and then reclaim one of the cap bands which is the first one so you reclaim the first one and then you close then you get three okay per side three per side one two three one two three so we add the first one unloop the two bands and reclaim the first one and then you close. You will do that twice more. Unloop the two bands again. And reclaim the first one and close. And then you get the last one. Unloop the two bands again. Reclaim the first one. And close. That's it for that side. You go to the other side. So you push. You push the bands to the other side of the hook. And then... You remove the first band and reclaim that cap band again. And then you close. Then you get the first of the three bands. This first one. Unloop the two and reclaim the first one. And close. And then you get the next one. Unloop the two. Reclaim the first one again and close. And for the last time, you get the first one. Unloop. And then you close. Ta-da! <clears throat> okay? Someone commented on my YouTube. Please do not speak English in in, in, the, in Filipino. We call it maarte. But actually, I am speaking randomly. <laughs> it's not maarte English. I am not trying to sound elegant or trying to sound anything. It is just me. So if you do not like it, you can put it on mute if you want. It is okay with me. You can also unsubscribe. It does not matter because I cannot force anyone to watch. It's up to you. This is just a guide. Okay? So, you can always go and watch something else. But thank you. Thank you so much for all your comments. I appreciate it. But the way I do it is just having fun. <laughs> I'm not trying to think so much about it. Okay? I am just enjoying it. Anyway, here. So, now you're done with that. Okay, so the first step you will do, and this is just for the beginning, you will cross the middle bands only for this step. Okay, and then you will place the first of your next color. So the first one is the gold mint. Okay, and then you close. Uh, now you put it on your hook and then you unloop all five. Keep the sequence correct. Okay, so you will unloop all of these five bands. Okay, so you can see five bands now. You will reclaim this third one, the one sticking out. Reclaim it. 
and then you will close okay then you repeat the same step on the other side you get your gold mint and unloop the five again three four five and reclaim number three and close okay and now comes the middle band which is for this one so you get your first middle band and you can remove this first band with your gold and unloop the middle four when you unloop this middle four you will reclaim the middle two bands which will be for me the green so you unloop the four first one two three and four and now you will reclaim the two middle which are the greens so you reclaim the two and then you close Ta-da! it's kind of hard to determine really here where the start of the sequence is but <laughs> i guess we can figure that out anyway so there so now you have one each of your green and remember we have three per side so you will get two each per side okay so you get two of the greens again two on each side okay so the way i see it we can make this the beginning of the sequence okay so just remember you will continue from here you add two per side and then after the two it will be followed by oh, let's just do this two first okay so the two per side so you get your first band and loop these first two and then you will reclaim the second one and then close the next one is another gold mint so second one and loop the first two again and reclaim only the first band and then you close so you have five bands on this side you will now go back to your white okay so you start putting the first of your white again so this is actually there one on each side okay so you get your white and unloop these five bands same as we did earlier so there's no more crossing so you unloop the five bands and you reclaim the third again and then you close now you can go to the other side and repeat the same steps of adding the two greens and one white so you get your first green and loop the first two and reclaim the second again this second band and then close you get the second of the green and loop the first two bands and reclaim the first one only and then close then now you go to your white you unloop the five bands one two three four five and reclaim the third one again and then you close see and now you're back to adding the gold again so now you have a gold so you get your gold middle band remove the first band and unloop the middle four again and then you will reclaim the middle two again Ta-da! okay and now you're back to step one the two see it's super easy so one more time but you go back to step one if you're alternating colors this becomes white then this becomes green so just remember white green white green white green so that's your pattern so if you're whatever color you're using first color second color first color second color that's how you do it okay so one more time you get your white and loop the first two and reclaim the gold the second band then close you get the second white and loop the first two again reclaim the first one and then close and then you get 
the following color, which is the gold mint, and loop the five. One, two, three, four, five. And then, reclaim number three again. And then close. Okay? Ta-da! And then you go to the other side. So you get your white again. Because you already have one. So you will all you will know because you have your middle band here and you only have one color of the first one you did. So now you put your second one. I don't know if that made sense, but anyway. <laughs> Reclaim the second one. And then close. Ouch, my shoulder hurts. And then you get your second white. And loop the first two. Reclaim the first one and then close. And lastly, you go back to the gold mint. Because you, you unloop the five, you already have five. One, two, three, four, five of the white. It's time to go to the next color. Okay, the next segment. So you have five to unloop. Two, three, four, five. Okay. Then you will reclaim. Oops. Ah! <laughs> you will reclaim the third band again. The third. And then close. See? It's so easy! Okay. I will do it one last time and then I will show you how to make the beads or how to place the one with the beads because some people are requesting for it. Okay? So now, you go back to the middle band which is the gold for under these four. Remove the first band with your gold and loop these four. One, two, three, four and reclaim the two middle. And close. This color scheme looks beautiful. Very simple but clean. See? Okay. And then we go back to the green. So you get your green. Add two of those. So unloop the first two. Reclaim the second band. And close. Another green. Unloop these two. Reclaim the first one and close. And then you go back to the white because you now have five bands. And loop the five bands. Three, four, five. And reclaim the third. And then close. And then you go to the other side. Hide, hide, hide. Okay. You add two more gold mints. And loop the first two. Reclaim the second one and close. And then you unloop for the set the third one, you unloop the first two again and reclaim the first one and close. And you have five again. So you go to the next color. So it's white. Unloop all five and reclaim number three. And then you close. Ta da! See? It's super easy and it's pretty. Okay? And when you're done with this, all you have to do is to just get another white band and unloop all of these. And pick up the middle two. Then you can put your C clip there. Very secure. Okay? Now I will show you how to put the bead. Okay. Let us move on. That's how it looks. Okay. Now I will show you how to bead. Let me get my other set. Then we shall begin. Okay. So we shall start from the 10 band configuration again, which is the beginning like this. Okay. This is how we started, remember? So if you go to the beginning of the tutorial, and if you forgot, well, you can just repeat. <laughs> okay. So let me just wait. What did but what happened here? Wait, let me just fix it. What happened? Wait, no, 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 no. It's not supposed to be like that. Wait, let me fix this. One of the bands got displaced. Okay, let's fix this. Okay, here we go. There we go. Okay, so if you are going to put the bead, 
So let's start from the beginning. So here we cross this two. Okay. And then you get your gold mint because that's your next color. So you get your oops. Oops. Get your gold mint and unloop the five bands. Remember, five bands. One, two, three, four, and five. And reclaim number three. And then close. Then you go to the other side. Do the same thing with the five bands. Gold mint. Unloop the five. Three, four. And then five. Pick up the third. And then close. Okay, so here. We add the center band, the gold, remember? Okay, so for those who still don't know, all you have to do is to get a threading cord. This is your threading cord. Let's remove this. You know this already. And then, you simply get a band that you will use for the center. And put it on your threading cord, just like that. And then get your bead and place the threading cord in there. And voila! Okay? If you're... Um, hole is a, if the hole of the bead is too tight you can use pliers to pull it like that okay help and then tuck it okay? like tug it really as much as you can so that it becomes thin and it goes into the bead so that's how it's supposed to look okay so now how to place it is different you hold your bead up here in the center against the center of the six because you have six bands and this is where it's supposed to go right now it's supposed to be remember under these four these are the four bands that you should have the gold and then you pick up the middle two remember so what you do you separate those two and you place these two on top of the gold band just like that and then you hold this other gold band against this one. So you hold it together. Like that. Okay. That's how I do it. This is the best suggestion I have. Then you remove both of them together with the two. And then now you catch the other side. And unloop these two. So now you have the four on there. But you will pick up the two middle bands, which are the gold mints. So you just push down the white and pick up that green. And then pick up the one the other side too this is a bit of a it's a bit fiddly but you just have to be patient there you go then you can now close it Ta -da! and you got your bead in there see it's so pretty now you can continue with the green so you need two green per side because that's the color scheme remember so you remove the first two and reclaim the second band Get the second one and unloop these two again and reclaim the first one. Ta -da! Now you have five again. So you go to your next color, which is the white. Unloop all five, two, three, four, five, and pick up the third band. Close. And you're ready to go to the other side. Okay. <laughs> so many people thought that was really crazy. <laughs> anyway, so you now go and do the other side. So you add your first and unloop these two. Okay. And then you pick up the second band and then you close. And you get your third gold band and unloop the first two again. Okay, and then you pick up the first one and close, and then you get the white and unloop the five bands, and then you pick up the third. Okay, so there you have it. Ta da! So I'll show you the beading once again. So you get your next beaded band. Place it in the middle like that and then get these two bands on top of it 
like that. Then you hold the gold band against the first band like this and remove. And then you catch the other side of that beaded band and unloop the next two. And you pick up the two middle bands again which are now the whites. So you pick up the two middle bands and then you close. There you go. And then you go to the white again. So you add two more each side. There you go. One and two and pick up the second band. Yeah. Then close and get another white, the third white, and then loop the first two. Reclaim the first one and close. And now you have five. You go back to gold mint. And loop the five bands and reclaim the third band. Close. Now you go to the other side. You get the first of the whites and unloop these two and reclaim the second one. Then you get the second white and loop the first two and reclaim the first one and close. And then get the gold mint for the five and reclaim the third one. One, two, three, four, five. And reclaim the third. Hey, come here. <laughs> okay, there you go. Okay. See, it's so easy. One last time. Just so that you can really get it. It's now 21 minutes long. Okay, so put your gold against these and get these two on top of the gold band. And then you get the gold and put it against the first band and remove. And then you catch the other side of that gold band and unloop the next two. And you reclaim the two middle bands. One, two, and then you close. Ta-da! Ta-da! Okay. And then you will again go get your green and loop the first two. Pick up the second one. Close. And get another green. And loop the first two. Reclaim the first one and close. And lastly, get a white for those five bands. And loop all five. And reclaim the third. And close. And go to the other side. And loop the first two. Pick up the second one. And close. And get the last mint. And loop the first two, pick up the first one, and close. And lastly, get the white for those five bands. One, two, three, four, five, and reclaim the third band. And close. And there you go. You're done. So you basically close the same way. All you have to do is get another white band. And then loop all of these. Actually, it doesn't matter how many kinds of designs you make or how many bands there are in the middle when you place beads. The way the method I showed you is the way it is. It's even if it's 10 bands or 2 bands or 3 bands or 4 bands, you simply have to put the bead in the middle of where it's all supposed to go to and then just place the bands that are supposed to go on top of the, uh, the beaded band on top. And that's how you do it. So anyway, here, and then you reclaim the middle two. And then you close. See? Ta-da! It's a beaded, 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 beaded. All you gotta do is beat it. Okay? So, this is the beautiful Sabrina bracelet. Okay? I hope that you were able to learn some beading steps out of that. So, beautiful Sabrina bracelets.
because it's part of <laughs> Okay, created by the fabulous Janet today. And when you make the bracelet, please don't forget to hashtag Jay's Alvarez, Sabrina Bracelet, and Janet today. I'm excited to see your renditions. Bye!